Charles, I talked to you last month. Uh, we were texting back and forth and about Tyran. Yes, Could you sir. kind of go a little bit more in depth about him as an example about coming here and how much that played into your decision? Uh, you know, just just having somebody you know from where I'm from, and uh, he he went through the same process I'm going through now, and it's just you know it's a big help just having him to just you know get some time lean on. One of the things he said that he had was a lot of hunger, and that when you're JC, you got to have hunger to stick yeah. it out. What is your hunger level, and how much did that was that something that the staff saw in you? One of the reasons why they wanted you to come here. I think that that uh, you know. Because you go on JUCO, like it, you have to have a certain grit about you, and and I know I'm hungry. I know he's hungry, and uh, you know we're gonna come in here and work. And um, I think that they seen, they saw that, and um, yeah, I'm just just ready to you know work. Yeah, Charles. Uh, I guess when you were you know making the you know process to you know get to the Division One level, when you were looking at you and see what were some of the things about it that stood out to you, maybe their offense or just you know whatever. What were some of the things that stood out to you about? Um, you know, uh, obviously it looks great. You know, that probably one of the best facilities in the country, and um, it's just the family like to make you feel like family here. You know, coaching staff they real you know down to earth. Coach Brown he's. He's one of the best Hall of Fame coaches, and he'll, you know, talk to you like you, you know, a regular person. And it just, it's a, a great feel. You mentioned the facility. What was it like coming in here and realizing, okay, this is where your football stuff's going to happen now? It's, a, you know, a big difference, you know, you know going JUCO. I, I, we had top of, we had, you know, one of the best facilities in JUCO. But, uh, you know, this place is, it's different, and uh, I feel like they have everything in place for you to, uh, you know, excel, you know, take the game to the next level. And I'm going to try to, uh, I'm going to try to take the best uh, advantage of it. Charleston, what can you bring this team? Do you think? Uh, they don't have a, um, a hard worker, um, somebody who's um, just for the team, you know, winning, and. Um, Your, uh, your stats are pretty impressive out of high school. Were you recruited by some bigger programs out of high school? Like, what was kind of, why did you go the JUCO route, basically? Uh, yeah, that was, they recruited me, you know, uh, D1 schools around uh, Mississippi. But I guess, uh, you know, I was just, you know, and I, didn't, I was under recruited, and I just, they didn't, they didn't uh, offer me, so. How much does that drive you? I imagine that's that's the kind of thing that stays with you. Yeah, I think about it all the time, you know, uh, during workouts, uh, getting prepared for, you know, the season. And, and it, you know, I got a chip on my shoulder. You're from a pretty small town. Was it easier? Is it, did you look at it like it's easier to get noticed at a JC? And that was one of the selling points about going that route? Uh, well, my, I mean, I really just, I didn't, I mean, as I say, I was unrecruited. And um, my JUCO is actually 30 minutes away. And um, yeah, so I guess, uh, you know, how has it been getting acclimated, you know, to everything, obviously, you know, coming into the summer, you got, you know, camp coming up next month. How has it been getting acclimated to everything? Uh, the first week is, uh, it was kind of a little rough, but uh, yeah, I've, you know, I went back home, you know, trained a little bit myself, you know, ran. And I came back and, you know, I've been doing, you know, pretty good. And I've, I've been, you know, getting used to it. So what do you feel are, you know, some of the main, uh, you know, strengths of your game, uh, you know, that you kind of bring to, you know, the running back room? Obviously, you know, there's a kind of range of players in there as well. But what do you kind of feel like, you know, some of the traits that you bring to the table? Well? Um, I think I'm, a, you know, every down back. Uh, I can do, you know, all purpose, and uh, you know, I just want to contribute to the room as as much as I can, you know. And where do you see yourself fitting in on the field? I mean, do you, do you think you can get on the field? I mean, Omarion's obviously probably going to get a lot of carries, but where do you still see yourself sort of fitting in on the field? Uh, I'm just gonna, uh, you know, keep working, you know, keep doing what I do, what I can do, and. If the opportunity comes, I'm going to take advantage of it.
How much time have you spent with Amari? What are your thoughts about him? Uh, I know he's a very hard worker, and then obviously he put up great numbers uh, last year. Uh, I'm looking to learn from him a lot, and um, yeah, that's, that's about it. Who would you say, if anybody, do you model the game after? Um, to my like recent prison. <laughs> Anyone? Uh, I kind of like, uh, you know, Bucky Irvins, uh, kind of Jamir Gibbs, maybe. Yeah, I like, I like them. Like somebody can do everything real really quick, uh, explosive. Has Dooley helped with you getting acclimated here since you guys are sort of Juco bandits and all that, you know? Yeah. I mean, Same place? Yes, sir. Uh, we actually played against each other, and we, you know, we climbed about that all the time. Yeah. And it's just, uh, yeah, it's just it's been a big help for me, you know, getting comfortable here. Yeah, he supposedly doesn't talk that much, but is he giving you, what sort of advice is he giving you, if any? Uh, I don't think we just give advice, but I mean, really just working hard yeah. and just staying consistent. We were just talking with Josh Wilson about his piano playing, but wanted to know if there's a fun fact about you or a secret talent I'm a really good Madden player, <laughs> and uh, I guess ping pong too. Okay. Yeah. Both of which will be tested in the players' lounge. It's a good point. <laughs> yeah. 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 We, we need ping pong video now. Yeah. The evidence. You gonna play it yourself in college football 25? Yeah, I'm, uh, I think I'm being a uh, <laughs> roster update. Yeah, I'm definitely going to do that. Yeah, they got to get that refreshed, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. You guys good? good. All right. Thanks, Charles. Appreciate it.